The A's find themselves hanging around the 500 mark as we head into May for a report on their start. Here's Heidi Watney. Matt, this group has had some ups and downs in April, so we may not have seen enough yet to know what to make of them. The players are adamant, though, that they can be a lot better than what their current record indicates, and they're determined to get rolling sooner rather than later. Okay, thank you, Heidi. Here comes the first pitch. The, the catcher, number 20. Well behind that Robert fastball, it's a swinging oh strike. Yeah, guys, the key to hitting in the big leagues is to hit off the heater, and this guy is obviously sitting something else. Behind 0-2 now. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. And he takes strike three called on the fastball, one gone. Now the pitch. And no swing, apparently, ball one. Well, he punched out the last guy, but he didn't get any favors from the blue on the first pitch in this at bat. Probably should be ahead of this hitter instead of behind. High and deep to right center. Loriano on the move. He gets there, and that's the second out. The third base. Stepping up now, Alex Bregman. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Inner third let go. It's a called strike. You know, you look at this hitter, he doesn't care about being down 0-1. He doesn't care about having two strikes with him. He's got the utmost confidence in his ability to work back into the count and get something over the heart of the plate. Timing just to tick off there as this one's fouled off to the right. Count still at one and two. Three runs, seven hits, one error so far for the Astros. Fouled off. The one two misses ball two tough to take a pitch like that right there especially in a one two count you almost get in that auto swing mode great job to work the count back to even too high ball three three two counts are usually a time to challenge the hitter but I think he'll be careful here shoot now a ball hit high in the air deep down the line and left hooking just a little well the left fielders on it and that retires the side Astros here's Chris Davis now leading off for the A's the designated hitter Chris Davis. ready to deliver here's the first pitch big swing but he just gets a piece of it strike one Oh, one count. Here's the pitch. Swing and a miss here, and he's behind in the count now. 0 oh and 2. Hey, this pitcher better watch himself right here. The way this guy's swinging, he's got aggressive things on his mind. He's ready. Here's the 0 oh 2 pitch. Struck him out. Outfielder Steven Piscotti, the next to hit. Head to head against Chris Davinsky. He's hitless in three at bats. Comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Line drive, and that's a base hit in the center field. Sometimes the first pitch is the best pitch you'll see all at bat. Definitely bat. coming out of his shoes, aggressive baseman. style. First pitch, Derek base hit up the middle. Ball. Here's Jerickson Profar. He swings and it's a line drive to left center. And that's in for his second hit of the afternoon. Pro won't get him. Boy, Dero, anytime a lefty takes better. that pitch on the Good outer stop. third and drives it the Both other did. way, you have to be awfully impressed. Yeah, yeah, you have to be. It reminds me of Will Clark back in the day taking that ball the other way. You have to be able to play with the whole field to have success in the big leagues today. You set and the pitch. Softly hit down to third, likely no shot at two. Altuve for one. Return throw is in time. How about that? They do turn two and it. First offering on its way. Now a fastball, a bit too low here. It's ball one. And he popped him up. 
Olsen ranging into shallow right, and he tracks it down. Nice play for the first down. Here's into his motion. First pitch on its way. Or too high, 1-0. 4-3 our score here as we play the eighth. And wow, a very high strike, but a strike nonetheless, and it's one and one. Next pitch here will be number 100 through seven and a third. Man, I'd love to see a complete game. He's certainly on his way. If he can keep the number down, the pitch count down, he's got a shot at this. Yeah, yeah D-Row, this is every manager's dream spot right now. You're, you're one out into the eighth inning. Your starter's giving you some good baseball, and you could go to your better relievers now towards the end of the ball game. This is set up perfectly right now. Rolled slowly down the third baseline, but a foul ball, one and two now. This is popped up. Olsen has a play, and that's the third out. Your Will Harris complete. is into the ball game now, now as he'll make his defense. fifth appearance of the Number season here. Will Harris. Now at the plate, Nick Hundley. Career numbers against Will Harris. He's hitless in three at bats. Owen oh, won the count. Oh, one pitch on its way. Ground ball left side. And that's a base hit. So a chance for some important insurance here to kick off the bottom of the eighth. The batter, number 22. So a runner at first now with nobody out. And up next will be Ramon Laureano. First pitch of the at bat. Below the zone, a swing and a miss. Good job of making him chase that pitch down below the strike zone. That's where you want to pitch when you're looking for the double play ball. Swing and a miss. It's 0 2. Hundley gets his lead at first, nobody out. Swung on and miss really fooled him that time for the first out. So a runner at first. First now with one away and that'll bring in the left handed hitting outfielder Nick Martini. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Just able to get a piece of that for strike one. Set to deliver the 0 and 1. Drops one down here and he'll try to beat it out. And the throw is not going to be in time as he's able to reach base safely. The batter, the third baseman. Brings up the always intense Matt Chapman. Career numbers against Will Harris. Just a couple of matchups, no hits in two at bats. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Brantley is under it. Two down. Now Coming to the plate now, baseball. Matt Olson. He was Matt. retired via the ground ball last Olson. time up. Looking to keep this a one run game, the pitch. Burrell brings it in. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Now the Cuban import Yuli Gurriel single home a run in his last time up. Off we go in the ninth as the first pitch misses for ball one. Can't get around quick. enough and that'll move the count to one and one and he takes ball two and it's two and one rounded down the third baseline but this will be a foul ball as that evens things at two and two and he missed with it here so now it's a full count three and two well, the one thing he definitely didn't want was a long at bat here to start off this ninth inning. This could really jeopardize whether he could complete this game or not. Again, another foul ball. Oh, 
pulls this one in the air out to left. And not the start they were hoping for as the leadoff man is kept off base to start the ninth. Now that designated hitter. Here's the first pitch to him. One. Popped him up. Olsen in foul ground. Two gone. Now that first pitch of the at bat. Ready. Lifted the other way to left center. Oh, and he misses it. And on the play, the runner moves into scoring position now at second. And now, now that with the possible time run at second here, we're going to have a pinch runner as they try to get a little more speed out there. One and oh, the count. Marisnik at second with two down. Popped him up. Chapman over to his right. Makes the catch, and that's the ball game. So what did it take, if anything, from this one, guys? 